Hey everybody, I have an exciting video for you guys, and um, if you watched my last video, I showed you that I had a new baby, so this is my New Year's baby, and I'm really excited about him. He is reborn by my mom, and uh, I undressed him. She made him this adorable little beanie because he's bald right now. She made this for him, and she bought him his first sleeper, which... She used this to match the colors. So yeah, he had that on, and I'll probably put that back on him. But for now, I just wanted to uh, have him undressed so you guys could see him. Um, like I just said, he is bald, but he is going to grow hair <laughs> from my mom. Uh, she'll root hers first, and then... Because she did paint two of these together. So um, she'll root her baby first, and then she will root him. And I don't have a name for him quite picked out. I have a couple in mind, but I will let you guys know when I do find a name or when I do pick one of the names. But yeah, um, I'm just going to show you his feet first. Here are his little feet. Aren't they just so cute? Here's his little feet. And um, I know he's coming off a little more red, but I told my mom I wanted him to have a lot of color because he's newborn. And uh, he's not this red. Even my skin looks red for some reason. I don't know why. I guess it's just the lighting in here, guys. I need to get some reveal bulbs or something. But anyway, here's his little leggies. And this is a full torso baby. So he is anatomically correct. But I'm not going to show anything. Because of how YouTube is, which is a shame. Because my mom painted a whole baby. I wish I could show you his whole self. But... It's ridiculous that dolls are con naked dolls are considered inappropriate. But here is his little leggies. And I did squeeze him in. Well, not squeeze him. But I put this preemie diaper on so we could see his little belly button at least. Since I can't show you guys in his diaper. <laughs> and then here is one little hand. Guys, I know some of you know who this is already. But yeah, here is his little hand. Here is his little hand. Take his passy off. We don't need his passy. But yeah, look at that detail on that chest, guys. My mom is amazing. But are you guys ready to meet my New Year's baby boy? Ta da! <laughs> Here he is, guys. He is the Atticus by Lorley Eagles. <laughs> oh my gosh. Promise just pitched a fit again. She's been sitting there for an hour, I swear, and she just fell over again. She just threw herself back. <laughs> but anyway, sorry. Back to my little Bubba here. But yeah, he is a baldy for now. He does have barely there lashes. I'm, I think you guys can see them. But he does have lashes already. My mom rooted them. And this will be the color his, of his hair. So take his little hat off so you can see his details. He does have redder details on his head because... He'll be rooted, and I wanted to be able to see that through his hair a little. So, yeah, my mom's amazing. I love her work. And I'm so glad that she got to make my Atticus. This is a complete gift for my mom. She, she bought me the kit, and she reborn him for me, and she gave me the stuff to weight him, which he is super heavy. <laughs> but, yeah, this is him, and um, he will definitely get some hair. I'm not fond of baldy babies that much. This is a baby that definitely has to have hair. Although he does have beautiful sculpting and details in his head, he definitely has to have hair. This little guy definitely has to have hair. But yeah, um, I just love him. Thank you so much, Mom. The lighting is not the best in here, considering it is 5 o'clock in the morning. But I couldn't wait any longer. I wanted to show you guys him so bad. He just has beautiful, beautiful details. I wish you guys could see him in person. I wish you guys could see my mom's work in person. Maybe we'll get to go to the doll show. I'm not sure. But here he is. And here's this beautiful little hat. My mom just sat there while we were mat varnishing and, and knitted two little, or crocheted two little hats. <laughs> one for her baby and one for mine. And it fit perfect. She didn't even measure. She just crocheted it and it is super cute on him. 
yeah, I will do a name reveal for you guys, and I'll probably change him a couple times, but then he will be going back to my mom's house for hair. But I think she needed a break because if she roots hers and then mine, that's going to be three Atticus's in a row that she's rooted. So I may let her root my baby Ender that she reborn for me, my last new baby. My Yeah, I may let her root him to give her a break from rooting the same baby over and over again. What do you guys think? Root him or root Ender? And let me know what you guys think. Um, and I haven't decided if I'm still going to upload my, um, got glitter on him, Christmas video that we did or not, because I didn't sound myself in that video. Um, but I may redo, uh, just showing you guys the baby's stuff, but I really hope everyone had a beautiful Christmas. And I hope everybody has a fabulous new year. So, happy new year to everybody out there. Um, like I said, not a lot of people watch our videos anymore since Julie is doing her own thing. But for the ones that stuck around, Happy New Year. And for all you new subscribers, Happy New Year to you. But yeah, um, I don't need any name suggestions because I have a few that, I, that I'm already going to pick from. But thank you for that anyway. Sorry, the door opened. No, you shouldn't. It's my Joe. I won't show him here. Kill me. He'll literally... No, I'm just kidding. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and I hope you like him. And be sure to go to my mom's channel to see videos coming up probably Tuesday of her new baby. And thank you so much, guys. Bye.